Hey guys, Patrice here with another video. This time this is a Scentsy video. It's a haul. Um, I kind of waited and closed out a party from, I don't know, like kind of the end of last, um, I kind of started the party in the fall, winter, and I closed it out. Um, I'm mainly my biggest customer, so I kind of wait to get some rewards. And um, I was going to close on the 1st, and then I seen the announcement that on the 10th, you could order the bricks, uh, early access bricks. So I just waited. So saved myself $14 shipping. So and there was nothing really here that I really needed uh, before then. So we'll get into it. Uh, it's kind of a hodgepodge. So I ordered six bars. I didn't buy the early access consultant kits of the new bars. I just kind of smelled which ones I thought I would like. It was a testers and ordered. This one wasn't new. This one's new to the catalog though. Blue Agave Melon. I have this one. I really like it. I'm not a melon person. But this kind of clean melon is so good. Um, I got Mountain Sunset. This one's nice. This one's kind of a clean, um, kind of sound woody to my nose. Outdoorsy scent. <sighs> Getting wax on it. I really enjoy that one. Lake My Day. I enjoy aquatic scents. They're not my favorite, but I like this one. This one's got a really nice tone to it. Sugar Blossom. This is Scentsy's Bakery, but it's not bakery. I like it. I'm not a floral person, but I like this one. Um, but they should have this in the floral and what it is. People are going to be pissed getting that thing, and that's bakery. Uh, Wildflower Cotton. Oh, wait. Those are, those wait. Um, red Hibiscus Tea. This one's okay. This one's kind of a fruity scent. I'm not... Huge into fruity, but I like the smell of this one. And mango matcha. Yeah, this one's nice too. I like this mango. It's kind of like the mango or kind of... To me, it's kind of reminiscent of Dumbo Circus Parade, but something different. I really wasn't impressed with Sensi's uh, new releases this year. I'm just not a spring-summer person anyways, but it, this one really was just kind of like, eh. Um, what reason I said wait was I got the early access for the Mother's Day bars. So it was Wildflower Cotton and Blue Coconut Beach. So, um, Blue Coconut Beach. Oh. I kind of have a weird angle today. I just got off work. I'm trying to get this done because I like this. It's lighter, but these are cold too. So, yeah, this is a nice coconut. It's kind of like, this is kind of like what I thought uh, coconut palm should be. It's kind of coconut with a little bit of earthy, outdoorsy. I like that one. And then wildflower cotton. Okay. <laughs> so I like this. You definitely get like a cotton scent. And you definitely get like a floral, but not like a, a an overpowering floral. But I'm kind of getting citrus. I don't know if there's citrus in this. But I'm getting a floral citrus with cotton. I like it too. Those are both really good. I'm, I can see myself picking up more. I also picked up some bulbs. I got a, tw a three pack of 20. And I grabbed uh, a purple 25 watt and a blue 25 watt. Um, I don't have a lot of cut. Like I said, I, I'm mainly my biggest customer and I'm kind of getting really stocked up on balls, bulbs. So I also picked up uh, a laundry line in Fiji flower. I've heard so many great things and I really like it in wax. I didn't keep it in my club because I'm just not a big floral melter, but I really wanted to try it in laundry. So I just got the whole system. I also, so I also picked up car bars. I have got all the car bars now, guys. 
and I've either used them or I've got them all. So now I can, when these are all done, unless they bring out some magical new ones, because I assume this will take me into the fall. If I get some magical new ones that they didn't this uh, that they didn't have last year, that I'll have to get. But other than that, I can test them all. I got Sun's Kiss Citrus, Luna, Welcome Home, Go Go Mango. Clothesline, Mystery Man, Aloha Citrus, Squeeze the Day, look how yellow that is, Johnny Appleseed, Apricot Vanilla, Coastal Sunset, Magnolia Linen, and Watermelon Tangerine. So that is all of them, I think. One, two, three, four, six. Four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirty. Yes, I had to pick up an extra one just to be done them. So that's all of them. So I should be able to test them all. So I presume some of these summer ones are going to be lighter. So I got, I don't know if I'm going to take these out. I got three warmers. Um, I think I'm going to put the other one away and to put this one downstairs anyways. So I really like... Garth, get, come here, Garth, Let's try and get up on the table, I really like this, so I have my Toronto Maple Leafs mini warmer downstairs, and I kind of wanted to put it away for the summer and bring it something more summery, so I picked up that one, I wasn't planning on it, and then I just seen so much love towards it, and I was like, you know what, I really enjoy that, I'm gonna get it, so I got that. Garth, you gonna come say hi? Garth. Anyways, I picked up the Simply Diamond. This one's such a cute little box. This is the thing that I kind of laugh about this is that since he's like now you can get an affordable warmer. Well, they had big full size warmers for forty dollars, and then they increased the price of them, and then made the small one. $40. So it's like, well, you did have affordable ones. You just made them a little bit more expensive now. So, so this one's super cute. I'm not going to take this out because I don't think I'm going to use this right now. Just a very plain dish. I'm sure you can look and see other people's reviews. I just, I picked it up because it's, it's just very universal. I might use it eventually. So and the last one I got is the flower garden one. Um, I, I think I am going to use this one because it's summer. Garth is just not in the mood to say hi to everybody today. Are you Garth? Uh, just one sec. Sorry. Sorry. He was on the table and uh, he wouldn't get off. So I'm going to use this one. So I will take this one out. Um, yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know how I feel about this right now. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's like, there's like where you can tell where that it's connected and then all along, I don't know. I wish they had that in the back. Like, there's the back, right? So it's going to sit like this. That's the thing that kind of bothers me. It's going to sit like this. Where I was going to put it, that would be like clearly that line will be clearly visible. I wish they would have put that in the back. It's a beautiful warmer, and I'm sure I'll get over it like I do every other warmer. But it's just it that funny to me that they put that right on the side that it was so if you that if you don't like uh imperfections like that this is, might not be the warmer for you I didn't realize that it was I don't know what I realized but I didn't realize it was going to do that you guys think I'm crazy over that I'm sorry um 
I just thought that might be in the back. I don't I don't know. I don't I don't know why Sensi or whoever did this decided that that was a good spot to put the seam. So I'm not gonna light it up for you guys. But I've seen other people um do colored bulbs is what this one. That's why I picked up the two colored bulbs. So when I, the the clear one kind of blows, um I can play around with colored balls. So, anyways, sorry if that seemed like a Debbie Downer there for a second, but it just kind of surprised me a little bit that it had such a noticeable seam on it. So, anyways, that's what she looks like. She is beautiful. I really, I do like it. I'm just trying to see if I can see that that seam from the front. No, not really. It's close to being seen from the and there's see like there's there's one there too. There's one right there. And then on this side. I don't know if you can see it too. So yeah, if you don't like imperfections, I don't recommend this one, but it's a beautiful warmer, so I'm sure I'll get over it. And then guys, all we have left is the five new release bricks. Or the five bricks, summer bricks. So two of them are not new. The first one's Beach Daisy. I don't have the scent notes. It's the end of the work day. I'm just trying to get this done because my boyfriend has tomorrow off and the weekend. So I like Beach Daisy. Is it a love? No, but I really enjoy it. It's fruity. It's floral. It's beautiful. This was, I don't know if they, I think they had this in laundry. Um, That's fantastic one. And then the other non-new one is Cucumber and Cactus Water. This is from is it last year's summer collection, I believe. Yeah, this one's nice. It's, it's very spa, but it's fresh at the same time and green. My video wouldn't be a video with it. Poop shoot. So the three new ones, Pink Apple... Pink Apple and Nectar. Do I think I'm going to like this? I don't know. I like this way more than I thought I would. It's cold, so I can't smell it real well. But you definitely get that sweetness from the apple. But it's very, like, pink. Like, I know that's the name. Maybe it's the name that's throwing me off. But the ne Nectarine probably is giving it a little bit of brightness too. I really like that one way more than I thought it would. Um, Orchid by the Sea. Yep. Or orchard? Orchard by the Sea. I'm not very... Oh. The brick's all shattered. This one's nice. I can't even take it out. Smell the bottom or it will all fall apart. This is very aquatic, but there's like a brightness again to it. Oh, that one's nice too. And then the last one, I'm getting wax everywhere. The last one is Summer Berry Melon. This one I thought was going to be my favorite. And it's still really fantastic. But it might be like my least favorite of the first three, or the new three. Like you definitely get that melon and you get that berry. It's just very fruity. I But I like them all. Honestly, I really do. I, I really like them all. And you guys know that I am very vocal about when I don't like something. The seams on this warmer. <laughs> but um, yeah, I really, really enjoy them all. So... That's a great brick collection. That's probably one of the best ones I've smelled. So anyways, guys, that is my haul. Um, sorry, it's kind of an all over the place one. But yeah, I hope uh, you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.